Okay, bugs. We're the bugs. Everybody's go. We're the ugly and cuddly bugs. Let's party. We're the bugs inside your kitchen that you never knew were there. We don't come out when you're about, but bugs are everywhere. In the bin there lives an artist. His name is Doodlebug. And looking in the crystal ball is charming Mr. Bug. Bugins here tries very hard but never does too well. Grubbug loves to eat and Plugbug's nose knows every smell. We're the bugs, yeah we're the bugs. We're the ugly, cuddly bugs. We're the bugs, yeah we're the bugs. Bug alert! Oh! Where is it? Oh. <laughs> That egg whisk was given to me by Grandmama. Where's it gone? Ooh, what am I treading on? I thought I'd finished the syrup sponge. <laughs> Hello, oh. group book. Ah, Buggins. Have you seen my whisk? No. Does it hurt? What? No, I want my egg whisk. I need it for the macaroons. Oh, I've been there. Lovely beaches. What are you talking about? I've lost my egg whisk and I can't find it. I want it now. Oh, Mystic Mug Bug had it. Mystic Mug had my egg whisk when? Last Monday. She used it to clean her football boots. I've made custard with it since then. Ah, thought it was tastier than usual. <laughs> Someone's got my whisk and I'm going to go and find it. Now. <coughs> ah, no I'm not. Why? It's syrup sponge on the floor. I'm stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Insert the screwdriver into flap A and tighten. Uh, done that. Now, pull the lever towards you. Ow! After you move your hand away. Ooh, this is meant to be a pizza-making machine, not a mouse trap. Ooh, I'll never play the piano again. But you can't play the piano. I was starting lessons next Tuesday. Well, you just have to be late. Can we get this machine finished? Right, what do I do next? Let me see. Oh, yes. Take the egg with. Uh, right. And yeah. bend it in half. Oh. <laughs> oh, like this. That should do the trick. Oh, grab bug will be ever so pleased. Yeah, this machine will soon be producing the best pizzas ever. Just think of all that hard work that he usually does that now he won't have to do nearly quite so much of. You what? Well, I know what I mean. Grubbug's always saying we never do enough to help, and now we are. <sighs> oh, yes, I love pizza. Hot and crispy. Deep pan. Oh, yes, with melted cheese on top. And just a little bit of onion. And an olive. In the middle. <sighs> right. Oh, what? Let's get it finished. Yes. Right. Um... Yeah, Solar. Yeah, Gorgon. What do you get if you cross a chicken with gunpowder? Oh, well, I don't know. What do you get if you cross a chicken with gunpowder? An almighty explosion. <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom. boom. <laughs> oh, oh. Mystic Mudbug's amazing facts. Oh, the Japanese certainly know how to move up in the world. Did you know that the fastest passenger lift is in Japan? It can go up 68 floors in less than a minute. Mind the doors! <coughs> and mind my mascara! It's the cat! Dive, dive, dive! <coughs> Does a bicycle work? What makes the wheels go round? Well, the pedals are fixed to a cog. Around the cog there's a chain. When you push the pedals down, the cog pulls the chain around. At the back end of the bicycle, the chain loops round another cog. As the chain goes round, it pulls the wheels round too. And that's how your feet can make a bicycle work. Here's something else that works with the help of chains and cogs. It's a model of an old-fashioned lift. When the doors shut, a big cog at the top of the lift shaft starts to turn. Just like the bicycle, it pulls a chain around it. On the end of the chain is the lift, and up you go. Mind the doors. Bug alert! <laughs> Finished. Good. Pizza time! Oh, I 
I'm starving. Let's try it out now. I want pepperoni. Yeah. And marmalade. Oh, yeah. Let's switch it on. Uh, right. Uh, here goes. Two family-sized thin crust steak pan pizzas coming right up. <sighs> Can you smell that pepperoni? Oh, yeah. No. What's wrong with it? It's not working. Hit it. I'm hungry. No, wait. What? Oh, oh we're missing something. What? Oh, we need two digital alarm clocks. Do we? Yes, and I know just where to find them. Oh, and I could almost taste that pizza. <sighs> did you hear this one? What one? This one. What did the launching pad say to the rocket? You tell me, what did the launching pad say to the rocket? Clear off, you're fired! <laughs> 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 Know that the longest car in the world has 26 wheels. It's American and it has a swimming pool complete with a diving board and a king sized waterbed. Do you think the driver practices the breaststroke while he's asleep at the wheel? <laughs> nah. Hello! <laughs> oh, what? Where? Wasn't me. Well, that's okay. Let's go back to sleep. <sighs> hey, you two! What? <laughs> you woke us up. We were dreaming. Dreaming? Hey, that's too bad. What's too bad? All that business with Grub Bug and the feathers was just a dream. Hey, no, man. That was real. That was yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, the fire brigade got him down. Well, I didn't know he couldn't fly. Hello? <laughs> Hi. You were wanting something? May I borrow your alarm clocks, please? Uh, uh, no. Why? Hey, we need those alarm clocks, man. Yeah, my granny's on the jogging machine. You what? She's running like crazy. And we have to wake up at 12 to switch it off. But it's half past two. Oh, well, late again. Yeah, she'll be splattered all over the carpet. It's your turn to scrape her off. Nah, there's plenty more grannies where she came from. Hey, you can have those alarm clocks. Oh, good. Don't forget, you owe us. And next time you suck the hairs from off the bath plug, we get first pickings. I like the greasy ones <laughs> best. Dandruff, man, dandruff. <laughs> I'll say, I'll say, I'll say. What? What do you call a three-legged donkey? I don't know. What do you call a three-legged donkey? Wonky. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Doodlebug. I need pizza. Wow, this machine is one slick bit of technology. Cog wheels, plastic bottles, and more bits of tin foil than you find on Grub Bug's turkey. I made a man out of tin foil once. I gave him very long legs, and then I put him in a bowl of water. I wanted to make him water ski. I dropped some washing-up liquid behind him, which broke the surface of the water and moved him forward. I must do that again sometime. Machines are fast, machines are slick, machines are useful, machines are quick. Machines are noisy, machines can't think, machines are dirty, machines just stink. Are strong machines are helpful machines belong machines don't work machines part slick machines are stupid machines are thick
now. <laughs> I could give a pile of pizza something to think about. Oh, that doodlebug is ever so clever with his hands. Oh, I wish I could make pizza machines. <laughs> oh, look at that. What a place to leave an oily rag. <laughs> when you're thirsty, you have a drink. Food and drink give us energy to keep healthy and on the move. They make us work. It's just the same with a car. You put petrol in the tank, which is turned into energy. That energy makes the engine start up and so the car can move. Energy comes from all sorts of different things. The force of the wind provides the energy which makes a kite fly. Water can also be used to provide energy. The weight of the water filling up the troughs makes the water wheel turn. The wheel can then be used to drive machinery in a mill. And guess what happens in the mill? Wheat is ground down into flour, which is used to make bread, which we eat to give us energy. Alert! Have you ever been sat on by ten elephants? All at the same time? If you want to experience a similar sensation, then just dive down under the sea to the bottom of the Pacific Ocean. That's how heavy the water pressure would be. I remember being sat on by one elephant, and that was quite heavy enough, thank you. <laughs> hmm. I can never remember if I should turn the black handle or the blue handle. Yeah, I think it's the black. <laughs> Ow! Ooh, it's the blue. Ugh. Are you still playing with that thing? I play darts. I play tiddlywinks. I don't play craft. Oh, you and your mate can do. Oh, it's finished. <laughs> oh, what's this for? Ow! Oh. It's the safety catch. Well, you got that wrong then. Uh, I'll oh. ignore that. Let's make pizza. Ooh, I'm dribbling with anticipation. One perfect pepperoni pizza coming right up. Ah, Ta-da! Oh, doodlebug! Forget what I said about your craft being nothing but a waste of time. I didn't know you did. Oh, I must have said it behind your back then. Give us a bit. Right, everyone. Lunch time. Would you like some pizza, Grubbug? Oh, good idea. I'll make the pepperoni one you're so fond of. Oh, you needn't bother. Oh, you'd prefer the deep pan marmalade and sardine, pink icing or blue? Neither, thank you. We've made lunch already. Uh, once I saw two, Grubbug. Where did that come from? We've got a pizza-making machine. Hold on, I make the pizzas round here. Yeah, but these are proper ones. Just like you get in the shop. Proper? Ones? There'll never be bits left over ever again. Come on, grab bug, tuck in. No, I won't. <sniffs> Suddenly, I don't feel hungry anymore. <sniffs> oh, well, never mind. Um, doodlebug? Yes, plug bug. Pass the raspberry sauce. <laughs> Hey, man. Hey, what? Like, what do you get if you cross a stereo with a fridge? Yeah, far out, man. Tell me, what do you get if you cross a stereo with a fridge? Hey, cool music. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, real cool. Up, who knows what an electric eel is? It's a long, thin fish, and it lives in South American rivers. It makes electricity in its body, so that when it gets hungry, it can knock its prey out with a powerful electrical charge. Zap! I must say, I've always been grateful that I have an electrifying personality, but I do try so hard not to shock anyone. <gasps> So that's it then. 
just like that. You rustle up hearty snacks and petty fours for years, not to mention the bucketfuls of vegetarian moussaka. And what happens? It just gets hurled back in your face. You know, it would serve them all jolly well right if that so-called pizza-making machine overheated or singed the mozzarella or... or did something very peculiar if someone happened to come along and fiddle with the controls. Of course, they'd need a spanner for that. Probably a bit like this one. Don't do that! Hey! Don't do that! It's not nice! Sorry! OK. What do you give a sick lemon? Uh, lemonade, of course! <laughs> oh, of course. Is that after the first aid? Hey? <sighs> I think those are the finest pizzas I have ever tasted. Very true, Plugbug. Right, onward and upwards. Pizza machine finished. Time to do some craft. I've decided we need a television. Oh, great. We can watch cartoons all day, every day. Do you know, we'll never have to think of things to say to each other ever again. Hey, No, my television's not going to be real. It's going to be made out of a cereal packet. Oh, how incredibly useful that will be. In the bin! Right, my telly's going to be blue. I've drawn a picture for the screen, <coughs> stick that on. Then a strip of paper for the switches to go on. I've done the knobs and buttons out of sweet packet lids. So, stick those on the side so I can change channel. And two caps from a toothpaste tube for the on-off switches. Now, what shall I watch? Oh yes, bug alert of course. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, Whee! Hey, man, what's with this tick-tock, 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 wee? <laughs> so why did the guy throw the clock out of the window? I don't know, man. Why? <laughs> because he wanted to make time fly. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, what? I bet he had to buy a new clock. Yeah, pricey, man, pricey. <laughs> <laughs> That should do it. This heap of scrap iron has produced its last deep pan anything. Now, I'd better make myself scarce. Oh, hello, grab bug. I'm glad you're here. Oh, yes. Are you sure you won't have any pizza? They do come out lovely. Uh, no, I won't if it's all the same to you. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Uh, I've got to siphon the scum off the bathwater. I'm planning a trifle. Oh, he's got my mouth watering now. Trifle for pudding. And another helping of pizza to start with. Exactly. Switch it on, my mechanical genius friend. Oh, without delay, my slithery partner in machine manufacture. One cheesy and tasty pizza coming right up. <laughs> Ooh, it's never made that noise before. Oh, no. What is it? <laughs> How do you feel about congealed bread covered in lard? Not wild about oh, it. Well, that's what you've got. I've gone right off pizza. Oh, I think this machine's had it. Funny, it was working really well up to now. I'm still hungry. Can I help at all? Our oh, pizza machine is bust. Oh, that's a great pity. And we're still hungry. Oh, well. Come and have some of my bogey roly-poly. There's plenty left, with lashings of chilled gravy. No! Oh, two spoonfuls for me, please! Run along, then. Oh, well, you know what they say. Too many cooks spoil the broth. Ha! Ha! Ha!